Are they finally starting to wake up? Everyone outside of 4 time plays in this game and Tears of the Kingdom, so why do you bother to claim it's bad? And really, this is what I call the Zelda friends. I think this guy doesn't understand, but this is what I call the Zelda, this is, you know, these people are kind of the friends, okay? If they actually went online and just said, and basically said all oh, this about Tears of the Kingdom and Breath of the Wild, there would be a lot of people like, really? This is why you don't like Tears of the Kingdom? Because of how the weapon, the item select is, okay, or, you know, how, you know, again, a lot of modern games have basically been based around Breath of the Wild and, Tears of the Game is based off Breath of the Wild, so it's, Breath of, Tears of the Game is based off Breath of the Wild, so a lot of modern games, like, you know, use, you know, it's made the menu design, the worlds, like, for example, Power World is based off Breath of the Wild. Which, really, if Nintendo is really, you know, smart about that, <laughs> technically, Nintendo could sue Power World for ripping out Breath of the Wild because, you know, it has similar menu, it has, you know, similar world design, it has a cartoony aesthetic. You know, same thing with Genshin Impact, but a lot of modern, or more modern games, especially, like, the anime art style games are based off Breath of the Wild, and to a lesser extent, Genshin Impact. You know, as well, because it's a set of both games, you know, a lot of modern gaming. And of course, I'm talking about mostly like open world games that have been based around those two games. You know, hopefully, don't call, hopefully, don't call modern world, open world games now called Zelda Impact. Okay, like Metroidvania. Okay, why do we call it Metroidvania? I, and oh, it's funny, funny, it comes from like from one goddamn Fred and like Reset era that the to I, I still understand why this one Fred and Reset era basically just determined the entire genre of games, okay? I just don't really get it, okay? It's one whole genre of game and we're gonna call it, you know, uh, Metroidvania. Uh, based off these two very old games because my reasons. And yeah, it's just so annoying, okay? 90s kids are pretty annoying, honestly. But again, we have to still deal with them, okay? Especially Gen 1ers. Gen 1ers are the worst of them all, okay? Gen 1ers, okay? People who think Gen 1 is the greatest generation of Pokemon of all time. It is. The most popular generation, but calling it the greatest generation of all of its flaws, okay, you know, is pretty absurd. When you have black and white with its amazing story, then you have Gen 3, you know, a pretty iconic generation. I wouldn't call Gen 6, 7, 8, and 9 better than Gen 1, but, you know, Gen 6 and 7 really started the downfall of Pokemon, especially Gen 7. I know a lot of people love Gen 7 for some reason, but... And what, what, what did we turn from Zelda to Pokemon? Yeah, bye.